My name is Gina and I have type 2 diabetes. I'm pretty new with it. I've only had it for a few months. But I want to share with you the biggest mistake I made after my type 2 diabetes diagnosis. Hang on. When I got diagnosed with type 2 diabetes, my doctor prescribed metformin. Metformin is a medication that a lot of people who have type 2 diabetes take. Now, I was new to taking medication because I've never had a big illness before that I would have to take medication on a daily basis. And so I thought, well, it'll be pretty easy to remember to take my pills. I just have to take two metformin tablets and I'm supposed to take them with my evening meal. Easy peasy. Well, sometimes when I walk into the kitchen and I'll pour myself a nice big glass of water to take my medication, I'll get distracted. Maybe my husband will start talking to me or I'll see something on TV, maybe something important on the news that'll catch my, that'll catch my attention. And then I have to stop and go, okay, what was I doing in here? Oh yeah, I was gonna take my medicine. Well, one day I asked Jeff, hey Jeff, did I take my medicine? Yeah, I have a nice big tall glass of water here, but I can't remember if I've taken it yet. And Jeff said, oh, well Gina, this is the first, the first month you've been taking this medication. Why don't you just count how many pills are left in the jar? And if, if you have extra pills, then you know that you haven't taken your medication yet. So I said, okay. So I opened up my jar of pills and I poured them out. And I just had a few left. And I looked at the calendar of when I started taking my metformin and I counted my pills. And sure enough, there was two pills too many. So that means I hadn't take my dose yet of metformin and I take two pills every night. So I took two pills. The next day, I, when I woke up first thing in the morning, I went into my anchor room here and I went to check my email and I sneezed. And when I sneezed, thank God I was home. I did more than just sneeze. And I ran to the bathroom and I want to tell you, I went to the bathroom so many times that morning. I could have had a colonoscopy for lunch and I would have been totally cleaned out. And that's when I discovered that I had probably forgotten to take my metformin two times, not just once, but twice. So when I took those two 750 milligram metformin tablets the night before, I probably had taken really four metformins. So any of you that are new to diabetes or you've had type two diabetes for a long time, you know, that one of the things that can happen when you first start with metformin is it might give you really soft stools. But if you accidentally take double the amount of metformin at one time, you're gonna have some problems. To remedy this mistake, I highly recommend, especially for those of us who are younger and think, oh, only grandmas and grandpas use pill packs. Well, you know what? Everybody should use a pill pack if you have to take medication every day. So that way you don't make that mistake again, because I tell you, it was a very painful mistake and I was very blessed I was home that day or it really would have been a rotten, rotten experience. And you can get these little, um, Monday through Sunday uh, pill packs, you can get them anywhere. You can get them at the drugstore, you can get them at grocery stores. They have them all over the place. I bet you can get really pretty ones online. 
but I highly recommend, even if there's just one tablet you have to take once a day, get one of these. And so that way, if you walk into the kitchen and you poured your glass of water and you get distracted, you'll know, hey, did I take my medication or not? And you can look. And today is Wednesday and I have not taken my medication yet. So there you have it. So that is my first piece of important advice. Don't make the same mistake I made. Don't accidentally take your medication twice. And there was another day, evidently, a night that I didn't take my medication at all. But if you get one of these pill packs, then you'll know. I also have other advice on my Anchor Moments YouTube channel. I have a, I have type 2 diabetes now what playlist. And if you're new to type 2 diabetes, you can feel kind of alone. So I don't want anyone else to have that feeling. I know I felt that way when I first got my diagnosis. So I'm here for you. And I'd like to share any tips and tricks that I've learned along the way. I've only had type 2 diabetes for just a few months. And my first checkup after 90 days, I went from a 10.2 A1C to 6.4. And a lot of that success has been what I've done with my diet and some of the changes that I've made. So if you'd like to see how I have lost over 30 pounds and the journey on the way, because I still have a lot more weight to lose, and what I'm doing, you can check out the 444 meal plan videos as well. And I have lots of great recipes and tips for eating 400 calorie meals that are low in carbs. And they've helped me lose some weight and they've really helped me take control of my diabetes. If you have any questions or anything that you would like me to do a video about that has to deal with type two diabetes or losing weight, please put it in the comments below and I'll talk about it in the next video. Thank you for watching and I'm going to pray for you that you get control of your diabetes and if you can pray for me too, that'd be great. I can use all the prayers I can get. Bye-bye. Thanks for watching. Please click to subscribe and click the bell to be notified when we post new Anchor Moments videos.